Do you know what, Maggie? I feel like I'm living my best life right now. Oh. <laughs> also, look who's here. It's Rosie. <laughs> well done, team. Woohoo! <laughs> Good morning everybody, happy Tuesday and welcome to weekly vlog. Sorry I didn't speak to you yesterday, it was just an absolutely manic day. I've had a job come in for this afternoon which meant that I had to do all of the work I was going to do today, yesterday. <laughs> and it meant that I was up until like 2am but everything has been done, there are some exciting videos coming your way so I really hope you enjoy watching them when they go live. I'm off to the hairdressers today, I completely forgot that I had this appointment until they messaged me the other day and they were like can't wait to see you on Tuesday, I'm like what? But to be perfectly honest, my hair really does need a trim and uh, I could do with a toner as well because the colour is going all bleachy from the sunshine so yeah, it will be nice and I've brought my laptop with me so I can sit and work while I'm there so it's not wasted time even though I should probably consider it a bit of me time but no, gotta work, too much on. Um, and I'm excited to see my hairdresser, I love my hairdresser Helen, she's so cute. She always follows me on Instagram and messages me saying your hair colour's wearing really well, just currently stalking your photos to see how it's going. <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da! Freshly cut hair, feel amazing. Put a little bit of a toner on and just even things out. Put loads of layers in so when it grows out it's gonna like have a lovely shape. And yeah, we put super tight curls in so it will drop throughout the day and I'm very, very happy. Oh, just bloody love Francesco, they're amazing. Um, I have a blog post all about my sombre if you wanna find out how to get this colour. I get so many people asking me about my hair colour at the moment. Uh, that's because it looks amazing. Uh, so I've got a whole blog post on it. So if you type in sombre on the blog, you will find it. So yeah, I love it. The, t the curls are super tight right now. So they are going to drop out as I walk to town, which I'm going to do now because I've got that job that came in yesterday. Whew, and I've just had a quick change so I look a bit more presentable. And I'm off. Bye. <laughs> It's nice and cool in here. Oh, Puffy. Hello, how are you? You're very cute. I'm off to Pretty Pots. I'm going to go and do some pottery painting with my friend Alex. Um, Lucy was going to join us, but she can't make it. So it's just the two of us, but we're just going to power through. Aren't we troopers? <laughs> oh, how worries us having to eat all the cake by ourselves. Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday, although it's not a happy Wednesday. <laughs> I am going out this morning for breakfast with Lucy, which I'm very excited about. Just went to go and put my favourite trainers on. Look what's happened. I thought we were past the puppy chewing dog shoe phase. Clearly not. Clearly, somebody got a taste for mummy's favourite shoes. When did this happen? They've literally been like in the shoe holder thing for ages. It must have happened ages ago. And like he's chewed them and put them back. You are in trouble. Toby? You're in trouble. I know you don't realise what you've done because you have a two second memory but I am very angry with you. You're going to sit here and you're going to think about what you've done. They are mummy's favourite trainers. And they're not from Primark. They're new look as well. And a dupe in Primark. They're not as nice, but they're only five pounds. So fingers crossed, one of these fits me. <laughs> My hair is crazy. It's actually quite windy outside. It's cooled down a little bit today, which is quite nice. Um, I had a lovely breakfast. I was very naughty. I had full English. I didn't film any of it because I inhaled it within seconds. I was so hungry this morning. I'm not normally a breakfast person. I have to be up for quite a while before I eat. But when we sat down, I was like, oh my god, I'm starving. Anyway, so I'm currently doing a little little post here for Instagram uh, with a big supermarket chain. Very exciting. That's going to be going live next week. Well, the first part will be going live next week, so I don't know how much I can say. But I'm getting all creative in the kitchen and it's exciting. Um, and I found some shoe racks in Argos. They were like £5 each. So I bought two. Thought we could stack them up together um, and hide the shoes. Because I did actually find some in Primark. They're a little bit of a dupe and 
I basically got these because I wanted some like Adidas superstar kind of style trainers for a while and similar ones to the New Look ones for the same price as one pair from New Look. So I cheated myself. I don't know where the offender is currently. He's pooping. <laughs> I'm so sweaty after filming that video getting changed and unchanged in this bloody heat under the lights. It's just ah, a nightmare. Mad dog. Um, yeah, I think it went okay. I'm gonna go and edit it now. Although my camera broke halfway through. Well, it didn't break, but the battery went. A bit dramatic. Uh, the battery went, so I've had to change for this one. And I know the quality will be different. And somebody will be like, eh, the sound changed halfway through. Can you still hear me? Yeah. Well, shut up then. <laughs> Um, so yeah, hopefully that will still work. I'm gonna put all these clothes away. This house is a mess and I'm really embarrassed because Maggie's coming to stay and it's the first time that she's actually stayed around, I think. Yeah, it's the first time she'll have stayed around and it's a mess, like it needs a hoover. I need to wipe down and have a bit of a dust. And yeah, just a bit embarrassed really, but she says she doesn't care, so it's just the way it'll have to be. Do you want to tell the internet the other thing that you destroyed today? Tell them, go on. Oh, it was one of my wooden coasters that you decided to take a liking to. I had some lovely fox flavoured, fox flavoured, some lovely fox shaped ones that I decided to bring out after a while. One of those went missing, didn't it? And now one of my square ones has gone missing as well. And you think you're cute, but you're not. I don't know where you've decided to start eating coasters from. <sighs> you're such a little monster. You're a monster, a monster. We are here at Escape Live, getting ready to go into the rooms. I hope people turn up, because otherwise it's just me and you. Hi. And you. <laughs> and you, Hugh's here, it's fine. <laughs> I'm very excited though, like a little bit too excited. I organised the best of them. <laughs> oh my God, that was so fun. And just to let you know, we won. So how many clues did we have? Three? And most people have 12? Yes. Just saying. And also we got out with 17 minutes of spare. Hardest room in the place. Nailed it. It was really fun. It was a little bit fun. <laughs> Daylight in here. It's a good camera. This is Maggie. You can talk. It's no. fine. <laughs> Been surround sound. We've stopped up at McDonald's because both of us are hungry, and we also got the snacks from Tesco. So Maggie is staying with me for the next few days. It's really exciting. I haven't tried those. The Maltese button things. They're really good. <gasps> so exciting. Me and Maggie are going on a very exciting trip in a couple of weeks. Less than. Less than two weeks. Less than two weeks. I will reveal all when I know, because I don't know. It's a surprise trip, very exciting. Um, so yeah, she's staying with me for a couple of days. So we stopped off at McDonald's and we've ordered Happy Meals, like the high functioning 30 somethings that we are. I'm allowed that I'm older than you. <laughs> yeah. Nearly £3.50 for a Happy Meal. They used to be one ninety nine back in the day. Oh, it's here. Oh, <laughs> it's here. I'm, I'm literally Edward Happy Meal hands right now. I've got two boxes. <laughs> Don't drop them. Don't drop them. Tonic though. water between me legs and happy meals on me fingers. Best I'm. Sentence to that you'd be <laughs> Do you know what, Maggie? I feel like I'm living my best life right now. Oh. <laughs> just you, you know. You're not the only one in this relationship. I'm the only one driving. Though. <laughs> You've never been to my house, and I'm like, I've just forgotten to direct. Don't tell them that. We're supposed to be best friends. To the left. To the left. Everything you own in a box. To, to the, the left. left. I've got glasses. What have you got? In your chicken nugget box. What is it like? Monster Transylvania thing? I can't do it with one hand. Help! Help! Yes. You got glasses as well. What do they do? Mm, they're like little werewolf glasses. Oh my god. It was almost worth the £3.50. Oh! Stick them on. Let's have a look. Oh. Only broke them. What do they do? Oh, they're a bit small. I wonder why. That <laughs> Probably because they're for children. Oh no, they. I've got it. Got it. What do they do? I have no idea. Oh. Oh my goodness team, very, very exciting parcel today. So, I don't know if you've seen online, but 
uh, oil diffusers seem to be all the range at the moment. Everybody is loving them because they sit in your home, they help to purify the air, they give a lovely scent and they're nice and safe and you can play around with loads of different oils. Well, Neom have just released one and it's dropped through my door today. I want to get into it but I've only got one hand. It is so beautiful, oh my god. Because some of these can be quite ugly to look at but look at this it's white and rose gold and it's beautiful and it comes with loads of different scents oh it's amazing you know how much i love neom i cannot wait to give this a go it's just really pretty and it's gonna sit nicely in anyone's home because it's not too like in your face some of them are like crazy colors and all sorts but this is nice and plain i think it's ceramic um and you can have it on for different settings so you've got an hour two hours three hours it's got a light oh my god it's beautiful it's perfect and they've sent through the different blends so there is the scent to sleep with lavender sweet basil and jasmine oh my god um boost your energy lemon and fresh basil that is one of my favorites de-stress lavender jasmine and brazilian rosewood oh no the scent to make you happy is lovely neroli mimosa and lemon oh my god and you just basically put a few drops you fill it with water and then you put a few drops of these in and you just switch on and just let it mist and it's super super relaxing thank you so much neom i'm really i'm sadly really excited to try this out considering my living room already looks like a bloody neom shop <laughs> they're just the best candles look at what maggie's just made homemade guacamole on chili bread with a lovely poached egg oh she can come stay again Another awesome delivery that I had no idea was coming is this new product launch from Benefit. Do you remember these pens off of school where they had like all the different colours? Would you stop? All the different colours and then you just sort of press them down and that colour comes out at the end. There, it's now that. It's one of those but with brow stuff. So there's like a darker shade, a lighter shade, there's a, a definition and a highlighter as well. So you can literally do your brows with this one pen. How good is that? That is super, I mean, you can't see it because this camera's useless, but that is absolutely perfect for the mornings. Really, really quick to do, all in one go. And you can stick it in your handbag as well. Benefit, like, props to you. That is freaking awesome. That's well good. Even Toby likes it. And here we have a double layered shoe rack from our goose that was 5 99 for each uh, that Maggie has very nicely put together for me while I was doing some work this afternoon. She is the best house guest ever. She can come again. So I'm going to put that underneath there <laughs> and it's going to make it a lot neater and hopefully Toby won't steal any more shoes. Right, so we are off to pole dancing. Very excited. Have you done it before, Maggie? No. You haven't? No. I thought you had. Oh, this is exciting. So I'm going to go and dance on a pole. But just because we dance a go-go, it doesn't make us a ho-ho. What's, what's the lyrics? Uh, just because no she dances go-go, it don't make her a ho-no. That's a good idea. Exit to the lake, so hard, we're going to the disco. There we go. Oh my goodness, this is actually amazing. It's so good. So it's Jules um, Oliver, which is Jamie Oliver's wife, her pregnant sausage pasta recipe. Like, not a pregnant sausage, obviously, because that would just be weird. Um, but it tasted really, really good. There's so much flavour. Oh my god. Oh, and there's none for Toby, and there's no sausages left either. How sad. So this morning, goodness me, look at my boobs. <laughs> yeah, just don't, just don't even, they are like a heaven to behold. They're a little bit excessive, but I can't help it. Um, <laughs> I look like I'm shooting a mild porno. Um, so this morning, Maggie is trying to pop me off um, by <laughs> dragging me to CrossFit. Yes, we're officially going to CrossFit. Well, she's one of those people anyway, um, but I'm not. But it could be the start of a brand new me. We will be. Either that or it might be the last time I ever speak to you guys. R.I.P. R.I.P. X. Like, 
like I've been through hell and back. I haven't been to CrossFit. Um, it was really fun actually. Very much enjoyed it. Thank you very much for taking me. Welcome. If it wasn't so expensive, I'd probably do it. But um, there's a few like little membership deals on the website, so we're just having a look on there. I might might think about it. Might think about it. It was hard work though. I think I'm going to be dead tomorrow. Anyway, um, I'm trying out my new Toby. Get off. Uh, my new Neom Wellness Wellbeing Pod thing. So there we go. Put it in between my uh, little pillow candles, which are dirty and need a bit of a wipe down but it's so pretty it's really nice it's sort of super super discreet and it's uh, currently wafting out a fantastic scent thank you very much Neo. maggie's building again she's building a new lamp oh this big one isn't it it is a big one what <laughs> she said <laughs> we have made the lamp and it looks very stylish indeed however i have smeared the walls <laughs> trying to clean them so uh yeah might need to paint next <laughs> So we're having a girls night tonight because we are going to the crystal maze tomorrow. How many people are there? Seven. So we've got me, Scott, Maggie, Ellie, Lucy, Matt and Rosie. And we're very excited. We're going to watch it, in fact, on the telly. Not us doing it, obviously, but the telly one. Get some tips. But tonight, wine. Team prep. We need a team name. Uh, me too. We need to get a team name on the go. Uh, and we're going to have some fish and chips. So we've been roped into watching the notebook for the very first time and yeah I'm not invested at all <laughs> yeah with Ryan Gosling on the stream bloody do <laughs> you got your twill <laughs> Maria we made it to the crystal maze are you excited Scotty <laughs> that means yes we haven't got a team name, so we're going to be called Toby's Angels because none of us, none of us can actually think about a team name at this time of the morning. Really Toby's Angels. <laughs> We've got no. What, what's it called? Go on then. Give us a team name. Three, two, one. Brilliant. Toby's Angels. It is. <laughs> Are we going to win, everyone? No. Oh. Oh. That was really good. We got ten crystals, and the maximum, the, the average is like six crystals, is it? Oh, I didn't know that. Also, look who's here. It's Rosie. Um, yeah, I think the average is like six crystals. And we got ten. Really well. And we were a man down because we only had seven in our team. Yeah. <laughs> Absolute pros. Well done, team. Well, that was a very nice lunch. It's actually what time is it now? Five. Five o'clock in the evening. Five o'clock in the evening. I've just stood in something wet. It's not dog weight, it's fine, it's water. <laughs> um, yeah, I've had a really good day, but we're all so tired now because we're old ladies, but we need to get back in the game. I've just had a Red Bull to try and pick myself up. Oh, it's you in the bo I didn't know. Oh, I was like, there's something in the background. <laughs> Ellie's just been having a two hour nap. Bitch. <laughs> so now it's beer time, and then we're gonna get all dolled up and go out on the town. We are ready for a night out and we've been getting ready downstairs in my bedroom all putting on makeup together and doing hair together like all the times I've missed out on by not having friends growing up and it's been really nice. Had a music on, got some gin, got my little outfit done and we're ready to party even though it's chucking it down with rain. <laughs> and here we have the wonderful British summer. Got wet feet. <laughs> so we've decided to just go full on retro today after the crystal maze. We've had shots, we're having shots and a chew, and we've also got Smirnoff Ice and WKD. Our teeth are going to fall out before we get drunk, can you do <laughs> Good morning everybody! Well it's actually not morning now, it's quarter past two in the afternoon. Had a fabulous night last night, it's really good Ben. And we actually feel surprisingly good this morning, just a bit tired because the doggos were jumping all over us all night. And Ellie was on an airbed, so uh, yeah, very loud. Um, but yeah, we've just been chilling. Maggie's made bacon sandwiches and tea and done the washing up. She just can't ever leave. We're going to tie her up, aren't we? We're going to keep her here forever. <laughs> So I'm gonna, I'm being hit in the face with a tail. Um, I'm gonna leave it here for the week. So thank you very much for joining me again. I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog. What's going on next week? Um, can't remember. I'm going, I'm going to a spa at the weekend, which would be really really nice with Ellie and another busy week work-wise. But it's all good. So I shall see you probably tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow, but next week. You know how the internet works. Bye. Chris. <laughs> Oh, Paul is bloody gorgeous today. Snack, snack, snack.